time and if my lipstick is weird it's because I've had this on all day and then I came home because it's Friday and I slept and and I'm not crying my uh, eyes are just annoyed because I've been sleeping with makeup on <laughs> and I'm still having the bad sound I'm so sorry uh, but oh and someone sent me a message uh, because I have not figured out what to do yet and maybe I won't be able to do that until I get you know my YouTube friends over here <laughs> so you have to live with that I'm so sorry um, and I'm so sorry that I haven't been uploading but I can't say that every time you know I will not quit but it will take some time for me to get back so I'm just trying to film whenever I feel like it but also it's not fun to film if you have bad sound you know yeah but today it's a haul and I really want to film it because I want to take away the stuff and put it where it should be and I have reorganized a bit and I've also updated my uh, inventory list so I can do my palette collection uh, and do that in brand order and I wanted to have the list updated because I don't want to forget anything because I don't have my palettes by by brand kind of and it will be really hard to do that for Revolution because I have over 500 palettes from Revolution. Yay! Never mind, let's start with my haul! And this is for January of course and I know we are in February but that's, yeah, that's life. And I haven't received everything I have ordered. Oh, I have... Yeah, I don't know what that's called. I think I've had this discussion before. And that's what my alarm is. Nej, Gunvald. Nej. But in Swedish, if I would say it in Swedish, I would say, Jag har lock i örat. Which translates to, uh, I have a lid in my ear. <laughs> so I can't hear. I don't know what it's called. But yeah, never mind. Let's open up. Pepsi Max Lime. Yeah, and it's Valentine's Day today, that's why I have this makeup on, because it's a bit ratchet now, but at work we said that we were going to have pink and red, uh, something pink and red, so I went with makeup, uh, and my coat is red and my backpack is pink, so yeah, then I could have black clothes. Uh, let's start, uh, so we can get this over with. <laughs> and let's start with i finally got these this is a colourpop palette but it's not colourpop i ordered uh from divina the exploders collection i finally got that and i also ordered from cleonad with angelica um and i ordered five from the stained glass collection so they look like that um these three are more like Toppers. I can't remember what that collection was called, uh, but this is the more jewel collection, I don't know. But the exploders I have been using every time I've done my makeup now. Uh, they look like there is two purple, two pink and three blues, but they are different. And they are so pretty duochromes and they look so amazing on the lid. I have been using them non-stop, I love them. I wish I had a palette with see-through here. Uh, but um, I don't have it so they all fit in here because I want to have them together but these I have ordered and I'm very happy about them <laughs> yay and then I actually I visited Lisa for a couple of weeks ago maybe a month ago and we were at Kix and I bought a Linda Halberg Santa stick I've been wanting to try this for a long time and this is famous so it's like I can do it looks dark but it's very sheer I'm not sold um, but I like it but I have to use it more to evaluate I don't think it stays put that long and then my color pop lipsticks are a bit better but it's comfortable so yeah yeah I like it but I will try it out more before I consider buying more should I have a system like always to put things I have talked about 
well, let's take the palettes and then I can move here. Then I ordered this. It's the Norvina Mini Pro Pigment Palette Volume 3. Um, I have said that I don't want to order from the ABH website, but my friend Madeleine ordered. <laughs> and I said, order this for me. So, uh, it looks like that. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. And I love these formulas, so I'm just suspecting this is as awesome. But, um, is this glitter? That is a shimmer, but I think it is a press glitter. Yep. Hmm, but they look pretty. And now I want to have something in here. Why did that do that? Uh, but I've not tried it yet. Uh, but I really like the colors, uh, the color scheme, and I think the packaging is really pretty. And I'm looking forward, they are going to release a big one and I'm just praying that it won't be a neutral because I, I don't want a neutral big palette but that is, you know, kind of, I would understand if they release a big neutral palette because that will sell. Uh, but I will probably buy it and it feels terrible to pay that much money for a neutral palette, so yeah. But yeah, it looks like this and I know the lights are bright but I'm, you know, trying to figure that out as well. But it's nine, no, is that a shimmer as well? There are five mattes and that one looks like a standard pink with glitter. That's the new black with glitter. <laughs> and then there is one pressed glitter and that is a shimmer. And I wonder if that is a shimmer or a satin. Oh, it's a duochrome. Ooh, I have not looked into this. I don't know if you can see the duochrome in this bright light. It's like a pink orange or something. I don't think you can see it. But yeah, that was pretty. Yay! So then let's put it here. Yeah, and then let's take these. I ordered uh, four UVS Place palettes uh, because I have them all and two of them I thought looked really pretty and I was like, mm, I love the formula so let's take all of them. So it's these, and um, my favorite I think is the berries, even though there are, no it's not this one, <laughs> this I have used also, uh, there are two shimmers, four mattes, and one of the mattes is a pink with glitter in it, and it's really really pretty, yeah, and then we have the purple, the violets, this is also one I really love, but there are four, what is that? Four shimmers and two mattes in this one. It doesn't bother me that much, but yeah. And I've used it, you can see on the top shade there. Uh, it's really pretty. I love this type of purple, you know, the more cool tone ones. Then we have the nudes. And this also looks pretty, but it's really nude. But I like that it's... I like that type of nude, actually. Because it's not the standard brown, is this? Yeah, that was kind of pretty. Now I'm glittery everywhere. Stop swatching, please. But it's not the standard neutrals. And that brown is like a dirty, almost mustardy brown. Yeah, I, I think I like it anyway. And then they have the chocolates. And it annoys me that they have a different print. Because the other ones look, you know, like normal gold letters. But this one is not. And this is the standard browns, but more cool tone ones not all of them but you know so i think it's that's unique you can't make unique bronze <laughs> but it's something else at least so i got those one let's see how i'm going to do this this is not planned well then i got um i'm going to show you but i got a lot of makeup from Marlin. she has decluttered a lot um and that's good, you know, to be able to do that. I'm not in that place. <laughs> uh, but she has taken out everything that isn't cruelty-free. Uh, because her channel is only cruelty-free makeup. And that's awesome. Uh, so I got all of that. And also makeup she she won't use. And uh, when she sent that, she also got me this palette. I wanted it. So she ordered it for me. But then she, she said that I was not going to pay it so I got it from her so thank you so much Molly 
and it's from Sueva and it's a small pad but it's bigger than the I think I have that pad here where is that pad? Oh no I have it over there but I think it's bigger than the other small palettes they have because this is the normal size eyeshadows um, and this is so pretty it looks like there is is that a matte I think there are two mattes and four shimmers it's so so pretty and they had it on sale uh, so yeah and it's good to travel with not that I travel a lot but I'm going to <laughs> and then I also bought uh, my is this my first palette? Yeah, this is my first palette from Nabla. This is the Cutie palette in Coral. This also looks so pretty. The red one. Ooh, I love metallic reds. I don't know if you can see it. Stop swatching. You do me snide, Gunnar. Can the two get pretty span? What is span? But I got this anyway, and I'm so happy about that, because I really like the color story. Mm -hmm. Nay. Can it start it pain? Stop paying it. Nah. Nah. Yeah, come down. Then I have the first thing uh, I got since my last haul, and I actually got this from Paulina. She found it and thought of me, so that's I'm so grateful. Uh, and it's the only one I didn't have in my collection, so it's from W7, the 24 karat gold. And she, you now it's called 24K Gold Rush, but you know, she's good, and this is, you know, a dupe of the Natasha Denona Gold palette. So it will be fun to try this out because I don't have the Natasha Denona palette. Maybe Angelica can try it out when she's here also because she has the gold. But um, Paulina has a video on her channel where she compares this to the Natasha Denona palette. So watch that. She's always linked down below. Uh, yeah, so that's that. Then on sale, I finally ordered the Carl Bible palette. It annoys me so much that I have all except soft glam. But I'm not going to pay full price for soft glam because in Sweden it's like $60. So, no. But it, it annoys me and I can't have them over there anymore because they won't fit. But yeah, I think this looks really pretty actually. And I swatched this in store and I kind of liked it. So, apparently I collect them. I don't know. So it looks like that. And then I also bought the Amorisi one. Love the packaging, even though I don't like when you can feel the glitter like this, just like the Soldier palette. But it annoys me that this palette is bigger because there are two shades more in this one. But you have all seen it. It looks really pretty. I think it doesn't look that pretty when you look at it like this, but when you see the looks people have done, oh my god, uh, the shimmers looks amazing and there are two pressed glitters in here and i'm not a fan like everyone else isn't either but yeah i love this it looks good man can, can it be here ma hello good man come Yeah, the beauty will be. Yeah. Then I bought this finally. It came back in stock at Beauty Bay. And I have been wanting this. And then I didn't buy it and so forth. And now it was on sale. And please shut up. Goodbye. Please shut up. Oh, not the last of it. It's too tight. 
I've used this a bit and I really like it. It's a lot darker than it looks. I've used that shade yesterday. I have a picture on my Instagram and it is a lot darker than it looks and it doesn't look that blue. But I really like it. It's, it's nice and I love the color range. Thank you Madeleine for convincing me to buy this. I love the fonts as well. It's Safari Rain if I didn't say it. Then I got two palettes from Molly. No, not Molly. Madeleine. We made a trade. Um, I can show you that first because I ordered from Makeup a Murder. I have ordered from them before. And when I finally got my order, they sent the wrong palette because they sent the first palette and I already have that palette. Um, so they refunded me after me harassing their customer service forever because they didn't respond. And I, they refunded me instead of sending the new one. So if I order from them again, because there is stuff I want, uh, I'm going to order that. I was ordering, you know, volume two, um, you know, the one. You can watch Annette's channel, she will show you. Uh, but I also ordered, and that was the reason I ordered actually, it's the pastel um, pigments so you know it's not neon it's pa it looks neon but it is a pastel and um, I think that is pretty fun idea and I really think you know I have used the creepy cute palette a lot uh, kind of in every look um, they look a bit neon but if you compare them to the neons can you see the neons there one. Yeah, um, they are not neon, they are really pastel, and it's just fun to have more good pastels, kind of. Um, and I love the bottles, I think it's. I think they are so cute, so I'm glad that they weren't wrong at least. Because then I would be really mad because I paid custom. So these were really expensive because I didn't get a refund on, you know, shipping or anything, so I don't know why I should get that either, but they turned out to be very expensive. Anyway, I gave that uh, palette to Madeleine, the one that I already have, uh, because I could keep it. And uh, I got two palettes from her that she was going to throw away, because they are old, but I wanted them because I haven't had them. So yeah, so they will probably not perform as well as they did when you bought them the first time, but I don't care. So it's the Master Palette by Mario from Anastasia, but we oh. Men Madeleine, du har lämnat penseln här i. Ja, nu snurrar jag den. Uh, she had... So it's this one and now I can try what everyone is talking about. She hasn't used it a lot. Yeah. But I have that anyway. Yay! And a brush. And then the self-made palette is called and it's really it doesn't look like my palette usually do because it's so worn out the print has gone away but it's okay my I'm, I'm a little happy I got it but you have to take care of your palette <laughs> yeah and this looks like this and I'm so excited about this one because I'll be wanting the shade pink champagne forever because Everyone keeps saying that it's not the same when you buy it as a single, and yeah, now I have it. Yeah, is this as big as that one? Is this the first of these? I thought Modern Renaissance were the first ones, but it is the same size. Did everyone know this? I don't know. Let's do it like this. Yeah, and that one we are going to save. And that also. And then I got, got, no, I ordered the Illamasca. I have not tried the other Illamasca palettes I have, but I ordered the Electrify. And it looks like that. So it's a rainbow palette, but it's a fun rainbow palette. like that anyway Oops. and it's not as heavy as, as the other one I think and then I ordered with oh where is that yeah uh, with Lisa 
and we ordered from Black Moon Cosmetics. She ordered the Orb of Light palette. I really want that as well, but you know, you have to limit yourself. Uh, but I ordered the Black Metal palette, and I was, we were both so convinced that this was a cardboard package. I don't know why. I always thought that this is a cardboard package, but it's plastic. Weird. Yeah. But it's the one with all the shimmers, but I thought, you know, they are grungy shimmers, and I really love that. And then there is kind of a duochrome highlighter in the middle. Men sluta, gumball! And when you order this, you got a brush. Okay. And it's a very interesting brush, because I think this would be good as a packing on brush, you know, shimmers, because it is like the other one I have, uh, the um, bristles are really short here in front, so I think this will pick up nicely. So I will put it here. Finally, I can put it away. But yeah, so it looks like, and I've only swatched it. I have not tried it. And that one has that chunky formula. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. But I was so surprised that it is a plastic one. I don't know if that's important, but it was just weird. <laughs> Ska vi flytta här lite då? Nu ska jag bara organisera det här och det vet ni inte vad det betyder då. Så. I'm just moving everything around. Nej men gumvald, nu får du ge dig. Det finns ingen som gillar när någon piper. Va? Nej, ingen gillar det. Like this. Then I ordered this one because it was on sale. I thought it was going to be much prettier. But yeah. Mm -hmm. This is UA Rose Cut Gems. So it's six blushes and a highlighter. Men skummal! Titta inte under lugg på mig! Nej, nu får vi inte. Looks like this. Looks really pretty. But I thought it was going to be pretty packed. You see. Then I got makeup for my birthday. I never get that because no one ever buys me makeup. And I understand because I have a lot, but you can ask. Um, I never got them that in a birthday present. And my friend Madeleine, she ordered a palette for me that I don't have. And I'm so, so happy because I've been wanting it a lot. Especially now when I have used another palette from that brand a lot and it's the shroud cosmetics arcana palette oh my god i have been using the creepy cute a lot but look at this and i know lisa loves it so um it looks a little bit brighter than it is it is a bit darker uh but oh my god i'm so looking forward to have i not swatched this either I'm so looking forward to using it. It's like I said, it looks super bright when I have it this close to the light, but it really is a much more grungy palette. Thank you so much, Madeleine. Did I say Marlene before? No, Madeleine. And look, and it's from Shroud Cosmetics. If I didn't say it, that was called Strobe before. That was interesting for my inventory. It's just like Menagerie Cosmetics. That was called Makeup Monster. I have them in different places in, in the new inventory. I don't like that. Yeah, and also on the sale I bought this. OPV palette. Tropical Dreams. This was much, this was, this was much bigger than I thought. Um, and it was actually prettier than I thought. Um, what has happened here? Have I put my finger in it? But the... Uh, shadows looks much prettier in real life than they do in the pan. <laughs> uh, in not not in the pan, in the video or in pictures. Um, there is a lot of greens and blues, but also some really cool red and orange. And I really look forward to using this as well. It's really hard to show you because this is so reflecting, but yeah. Happy. Then, am I going to show you 
I can show you the stuff from Colourpop because I have it here and then I show you from Revolution and then I'm going to show you the stuff I got from Aldi I'm just going to put these away and I ordered um, from Colourpop in different orders not in the same order and I also have one that is on its way but it was shipped yesterday it's so annoying but uh, Lisa ordered at the same time and she ordered a lipstick uh, in a shade that looks so pretty and I was like, I don't think I have that. So I took a chance and I didn't have it. So I'm happy about that. It's called Gold Digger and it's a matte X. Um, which, you know, uh, I'm not good at colors, you know. A red, cool, cool red, I don't know. It looks really pretty and I love that formula so yay then some lipsticks um I already had one lipstick from Sophia Nygaard or whatever it's called because that was the only one that was available when I ordered and it's the bikini bottom then I ordered uh, there were six uh, lipsticks in total and when Lisa ordered um I ordered with her so I ordered the four of the other five um, it's so pretty packaging, you know, with the bats. I know you can't see it in this stupid light. Yeah, but, um, you know, these shades. So it's Screamer, Mrs. Norris, Berry Mean Lipsticks and Fred. And then I got FOMO. <laughs> so I ordered the blue one as well. Brucey. Because, you know, I can't have five. I don't know what I'm going to use this, but hey, then at least I would have one that still has the bats on it. So yeah, these ones. And I love the Colourpop lipsticks, so yeah. Both the packaging and the formula. And then I ordered two ones from Frost. I don't, I'm not very fond of the Frost movie. It's okay. Um, and I didn't like when they had a Frost theme that they made it so... Childish is the only thing I can think. I will show you because I have the palette as well. But the lipsticks were pretty. Mm -hmm. And it's um, Going North. It's the Frozen 2 collection, but who cares? Uh, Little Snow and Going North. And both are red, but one is cool tone and one is a warm tone. I've not used this yet. I'm so excited. They looked so pretty and I thought the packaging was pretty as well, so I was like, give it to me. And they are both cream, which is my favorite formula, so yeah. Then I ordered three other ones on the sale and two is a velvet, no, one is a blur, because uh, I, I have been like that, and two is cream. So I have FIFA, so it's from one of the collections, you know, a collab. Uh, it's a red, a <laughs> uh, warm red, and then I can show you this. It's still crazy and common clover. Um, so the common clover is the blur one. It's a darker one, and it looks so weird. It really looks like a velvet. It's weird. It doesn't have the stars on it. And this is just, you know, a nude. I didn't show you the... Sophia Nygaard, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but because you know, you can just Google it. I showed you a bit. Can you please stay there? Yeah, and then, let me do no. I finally ordered this. This looks like, you know, Marc Jacobs highlighter, but I hate the packaging because it's so hard to open. I never have problem opening packaging, but this is so hard to open. This is from, you know, the Colourpop brand Soul Body, and I decided to put this in the Colourpop category in my inventory, I'm just so you know. And this is the Shimmering Body Powder in Pink Champagne, and I just thought it looked so pretty. It's a pinky peach with gold. So I will more have it more, that's not correct grammar. Good morning, but like a um, blush or a blush topper. It's so pretty. But the packaging feels so cheap because it's that type of plastic that um, you can hurt yourself if you, because it's sharp. Oh, there was. Okay. Gumal! 
Du får bara här. Ja, jag är ledsen, men du får bara här. Ja. Then I got the two uh, mon monochromatic palettes that I don't have. And it's going coconut. It's been out of stock forever. It's the brown one. Okay. And meant to be. I love these. Mm -hmm. That they can do, you know. They have made a green. And this will probably go very well with that. Uh, especially the sheen. Uh, but that they do another green. But it's mint. I hope you know what I mean. I'm so sorry. It's so hard to show you. But this looks so pretty. Then I ordered the, um, the candy button pressed powder palette that they had in collection with mm. Bitty. That looks nice. It has two pressed glitters and a super shock, I think. So that is the super shock. Then I ordered the two Frozen 2 palettes, so I've got the Anna, and these are cardboard, they are, these are not plastic. And it, this also has a pressed glitter in it, this is more like a warmy one, warmy one. Or is it more cool tone? Uh, mm, never mind, it's mauve, and that's usually is cool tone, but never mind, but there were some oranges as well. And then we have Elsa. And this is cool tone as well. And there is glitter in this as well. So I need to go to the bathroom I think. I'm so sorry, it's so hard to show you. It looks like that. Then Flutter by, which has pretty packaging. It doesn't show up, but it's super glittery. Um it doesn't show up at all. That's so weird. Because there is a lot of glitter on it. How weird. Can you see? No, it doesn't show at all. Weird. But yeah, you have to trust me, there is a lot of glitter. And this is also a mauve palette and I love mauve. And good as gold. And this is gold and oh, is this was this broken? Yeah, I think this was broken. And that's a super shock. Yeah, don't touch it. Yeah, it looks like that. Nothing super exciting. Now I have to hurry because I I don't feel like I want to go to the bathroom. Like that. Can you please stop moving? And then from Revolution. I went crazy and I still didn't order everything I wanted because they are so expensive now for what you get. But they came out with a Heartbreaker collection. Yeah, that happened. I was like, yay, new hearts! And then, oh, there are 11. Mm, so I had to make room, you know, in... I don't know if you can see, but I have all of them in here. So I had to make room in this drawer so I can put them in here. But there are three highlighters. Let's do like this. Yeah. Uh, so there are three highlighters. They are called Unique, Wise and Spirited. So they all look like this. And they are all duos, you know. So this is the lightest one. And then we have this. I'm just showing you a bit quicker. And then the darkest one. So it's more like the... And they smell like vanilla or something. Yeah. Then we have, let's see, because there are matte, 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 shimmer, matte, shimmer. There are two shimmery blushes and and six matte ones. The matte one is called creative I'm sorry but like I said quick kind brave charming inspiring 
and independent. And then we have the three shimmery, two shimmery ones, and this is called powerful and strong. That looks really pretty. So yeah, that happened. <laughs> then they came out with six palettes that kind of look like the ColourPop palettes, but smaller. And one of them came broken, so they Revolution has excellent customer service. They always, um, if something can comes broken, you can either get a refund or they will send you a new product. So they were sending me a new product. Um, and the one that was broken was the Courage one. They all look like this. And two of the shades were kind of black crashed. So this is a red, the pink. Why does it say red? There is not a lot of red in here. But yeah, you can see for yourself what that is. Then we have Majestic. Greeny, dirty, brown. And then we have the green one, Lucky. And then it's also yellow. This one is more true to color than the other two. And then, yeah. And then we have the blue one, Daydream. The purple one called Mystical. They have made these small palettes before. Uh, I have four of them. They have only made four. And they were called like Unicorn, Unicorn, Mermaid, Dragon, and Angel. They were called. Yeah. This is the purple. Yeah. And this is the pink called Sweetheart. Well, well, I guess it's a pink. I don't know. What shade is that? They look like that anyway. I thought they were cute. Then we have two new chocolate bars, minis. Oh, and they are eyeshadow minis. And this is Turkish Delight. I thought that looked really cool actually. And I like that this is a shimmer. Oh, I like that. I'm going to start using my chocolate bar palettes and reorganize them. So, yeah. I was at, uh, it's not a Swedish store, but a store in Sweden called Lagerhaus. And I guess it's German based on the spelling because we don't spell Lagerhaus that way in Swedish. And they had some uh, really nice organizers. And there was such a sweet person that worked there. I think she was called Emily. I don't know. But I told her I had a YouTube channel and she was so cute. Um, it's so bad that I keep telling people that when I'm not recording new videos. <laughs> but yeah, never mind. If you're watching this, Emily, well, hello. <laughs> uh, but I got some really nice organized that I will show you when I do my makeup room tour. But yeah, this looks really pretty. And then we have, did I say that? That was called Turkish Delight and this is Sherry. And yeah, it, it looks like you would expect. And these are like complementary, is it called that? Companion palettes or to the bigger ones. Then I got the new Flo uh, Forever Flawless palette. This is the Birds of Paradise. Look at that. And it's, you know, a rainbow palette, but with some really weird shades in it. Some of the shimmers looks so weird. Ooh, that was moist. Ooh, they felt really nice. Ooh. Oh, this is such a bad. Yeah, and it's mostly matte anyway, so I have high hopes for that one. And then it's the, I'm sorry, I'm so dry my lips right now. Showstopper that has like snake skin like that but yeah and it's a purple one so it's maybe duping every stars palette before it even came out so yeah looks like that it looks like there is one press glitter as well i like these packaging and yeah yeah i like it and then i bought two of the new reloaded palettes i bought euphoria 
Uh, I haven't liked the other ones. I know a lot of people complain, but the ones I have used, I really like. So, and this is both matte and shimmers, but mostly mattes. And I think they're a really nice shades. You know that coral one. And then I bought Empire, which is is it only shimmers? There is one matte. Why? Then make it all shimmers. That one is the matte. But they are more like grungy shimmers. I like them. And then I bought this. So dope from Obsessions. I don't like the print, but yay, I love green. So. And this is the ones you can now take out. Can I take this out easy? Where is my magnet? Why am I doing this? Is not the magnet in here? Am I making this up? No, there it is. Stupid. That's where. It is. There it is. Let's see. There you go. You can take this out. I have a lot of other palettes with this, but they don't have the names on it, so I don't want to do that. So now I have to put it in straight because of the <coughs> Men Gunvald! Varför skräms du så? <coughs> Hallå! 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 Gunvald! Sluta! Then I forgot that I also bought this from Colourpop. It's like a mini compact that you can put one shadow in. And it's also, um, you know, the um, exploders also fit in this one. So you can take that with you. Because my eye always, you know, I get water up. It water up. And then I have to fill it in with this. The last thing I bought from Revolution is the new donuts. Seven of them. And they are all eyeshadow. Um, this is the first one. This looks so cute. This is Berry Jam. Just like that. And it's a purple one. And it's all shimmers. But I don't care. <laughs> then we have Sugar Coated. Looks like that. They are so cool. But they are not, you know, squishy. Uh, it looks like that. How many times have I said, it looks like that? That was not a good closer. And then we have Custard Fill. This is for you, Lisa. And I have it in, you know, this, except this one, this didn't fit, but yeah. Um, and then we have I can't pronounce this. It's like toffee and banana together. Banoffee. Can you say banoffee? It's not the right word. <laughs> Pie is called that one. It looks like that. See if you can pronounce it. I don't know if you can see what it says. But yeah. It looks like that. And then we have mint shock chip. Do you think this is a green one? Oh, sorry about the light. Yeah, really fun shimmers. Why? Stop doing that. Why do I have that one? It should be. Yeah, and this is chocolate custard. This is actually a bit squishy. Just the brown. And the last one is Sherry Pie. And this is a pink, I think. Pink, I think. Yeah. So that's those. Let's put these back. And you will be there instead. Like so. And you can go there. And then we have the stuff I got from Malin. And she's taking even more with her. Uh, when she's coming. I'm not going, not going to show you detailed things, but some of the things I will show you uh, Because she got me a lot of things and I have actually given some to my mom as well some 
highlighter and lip product the lip products because i have a lot of lip products so she got like three nyx things and the highlighter i already have but you can see i have put them in this this is the stuff and i got some palettes as well uh, i got my gun var lille mamma pappa kommer snart kan du vänta lite I got the white peach one. I've been wanting this for a while. But I was afraid to buy it because people say it's bad. But I think there are so many fun, you know, that shade is pretty and that shade and that shade. Yeah, but I got it. I just hit myself in the face. And then I got Dream Queen in it's the Too Faced Christmas collection from 2018, I think with the swans and it looks like that oh. yay so happy thank you so much mom i have i have already thanked the people that have gotten me these things so i'm so afraid that i would sound ungrateful but she also wrote me such a sweet note uh and i am not the person that feels very comfortable reading those out loud but i cried when i read it of course and then Rockin' Rebel. This is one from Mac, if I didn't say it. Then I got this. I already had this, so I'm going to give this away. But I have to repress it because it was broken. This is the Huda Beauty Winter Highlighter Palette. And one of the shades is totally smashed, that one. So I'm going to fix that uh, and then give it to someone else because I already have this and I really, really like it. Then, okay, I got these. I've been wanting these for such a long time. Uh, it's from BH Cosmetics, the floral blushes. So it's all, all for, I don't know, maybe there are more. Uh, Caribbean Coral, Fiji Fun, Bahama Bronze, and Honolulu Hideaway. So you know, it's these ones. I'm sorry if I sound ungrateful when I'm showing you this quick, but. You know, it's, it's a lot of lip products. I can't show you that detail. And then two from H&M that I don't have. Uh, and I like these. It's pink, coral, and pink, pink. Okay. Um, so it looks like that. I love the packaging. These look really similar, but you can see that they are, there are a difference. And then I got this small one from um, uh, Benefit California, California and it even has the brush left that I'm going to pick out because I have those in a special place it looks like that it's so pretty let's keep that in and oh I got Molly's NARS orgasm. I will keep this for you as well. <laughs> More than you know if they get cruelty free again, but this is so pretty. This is and it's good too you can travel with it. And I like that. And one from Mac in Mocha. But I don't understand why it's called that because it's not brown, you know. And this one I'm excited to try. This is Clarine's Beauty Flash Bomb and Mom talks a lot about this. So that will be nice. Now that was empty. Yay! Then we have a lot of lip products and other stuff. Ow! I want to drink something. Okay. This time I've also been wanting. This is from the Too Faced Christmas collection. The lip products you got with it. It's Pink Swan Lip Gloss. This looks so Mm. And uh, I got a um, Lancome um, eyeliner and lip liner. But it's black. Yeah, okay, never mind. And I'm just going to hold this up so you can see. Let's see if I'm going to show you it. Uh, mascaras. Ay. Uh, from Urban Decay and Clinique and Brow Wow Conditioning Primer and you know 
there is a lot of stuff here. Then I got something really exciting because I have some of these, but I don't have these shades. And it's from Milani. They are more, you no, know, they're metallic lip creams. And this is, um, what are they called? Matt About You Chromatic Addict and Fancy. I love metallics. And apparently I'm throwing everything away. And then I got some from Pixie. Men gun valde för bilda lite. And some lip pens from Mac. Really exciting. And yeah, right. Uh, Milani Luminoso in this one. How exciting is that? Lip gloss, I think it is. Keep it full. Nourishing lip plumper it even is. Yeah, okay. And a lipstick. This looks so pretty. This shade from Milani. Naked is called. Look at this. It's so pretty. Yes. And um, from NYX. My mom didn't want this because she doesn't wear that pink, but I do. And this one. And then. Oh, look at these. Two from Anastasia Babies. I don't have any lipstick from Anastasia. This is Stargazer and Plumeria. Let's see if we can open those. Look. Oh my god. Isn't it fun to hear Goombal in the back? Look at that. Ooh, so pretty. And then I got her MAC lipsticks, and I only had three MAC lipsticks before, so that's really exciting. Oh, so I got, oh, don't drop it, uh, seven MAC lipsticks, and they are in, oh, oh, it's going to take off. Uh, now I'm showing you everything, either. yeah, uh, cream in your coffee, so, uh, cream cup, uh, blankety, um, is it amorous or amorous? I don't know. Uh, angel and ravishing. Isn't angel the one she loved a lot? Oh, it's so pretty. So she has, of course, you know, some of these things aren't open, but the ones that are, she said, you know, she has cleaned them, and I can clean them again, you know. I'm not that picky. Was that everything? I have to check in my book. In my book. And I feel like I'm having snow away right. Um, let's see. ABH Urea Sway Evaluation. Yay. Sending the Handbang. Colored Pop. Revolution. Yeah, I think that was everything actually. That was my haul! Yay! And now I can put things away! I'm so happy! And it's under one hour. Happy! Yay! Uh, that was all and I hope you could survive the bad sound. I'm so sorry. And Gunvald being annoying. Uh, yeah. I'm having high hopes that this will be an awesome weekend. So pray for me. <laughs> Bye!